Hello everyone and welcome to this video tutorial of PrestaShop gift card module. In this video, I'll explain you the process to configure the module and I'll also take you through the whole workflow so that you can get a clear idea as to how to use this module effectively. So let's just go to the PrestaShop back office. As you can see that I have already installed this module in my PrestaShop but there is no configure button available against this module. This is because this module doesn't contain any configuration settings as such. So there is no configuration button. In order to create a gift card, we need to create a product first. Then only we can customize the settings of gift card on that particular product. So let's just go to the product section. In the product section, as you can see that I have already created a product named gift card and uh, this gift card would be available to the customers at $500. So let's just proceed to edit the product. While creating this product, you can go to the module section where you will find that this gift card option is available. So let's just configure it. Then only on ordering this particular product, a customer would be able to get the gift card voucher of $500 because he is paying $500 to obtain this gift card. So let's just go through the each option that is available here. The first is do you want to create this product as a gift card? In case if you select it to no, then all the other options would be hidden and no other options would be available to customize. So for now, let's just select it to yes. Second is create voucher for every quantity. In case if we select to yes, then whenever customer orders two quantities of this particular product that is gift card then two different vouchers would be credited to the customer's account whenever an admin accepts the payment in case if you select it to no then a single voucher amounting to thousand dollars would be credited and a customer would also be able to use that voucher partially now next is select product in case if you select it to no then the voucher that would be credited to the customer account would be applicable on all the product but for now as you can see i have selected two products here so let's just go to the prestashop front office where you can see that the applicable product list is also available now let's just change it to no when all products would be able to buy through that voucher that would be credited to the customer account on buying this particular gift card. So let's just refresh this page. Now as you can see that this gift card is available for all product. That means on buying this gift card the voucher that would be create, credited afterwards can be uh, used on any product that is available throughout the store. So this is much whole idea about this select product option now next is discount type whether you want to uh, set the discount type in amount or percentage you can select that from here then next is what would be the discount amount as we are cre creating the product of $500 so it would be wise to offer the $500 uh, dollars, uh, discount because this amount corresponds to the voucher Whatever amount you would be filling here, that same amount voucher would be credited to the customer's account. The next is what would be the validity of the voucher that would be credited afterwards. So here you can select the validity of that voucher and uh, on expiring the validity, a customer would be no, long, no, no longer to use that voucher. So let's just go to the front office now and uh, let's just try to order this product firstly we need to save this uh, setting then we will try to order the product now let's just refresh this page before i go to or proceed to order this product let me just show you that this particular customer that is married doesn't have any voucher into her account yet and this is i am showing to let you observe the difference so let's just proceed to order the product first 
on successfully placing the order this particular order would go to the admin end in order to verify the payment and even though a customer successfully places the order on this shop he doesn't or she in case of this particular customer mary do she would not get any voucher yet this is because the order which she placed just now hasn't been confirmed by the admin so let's just confirm the order from the back end and see what happens let's just update the status of this particular order it might take some time to update the status so we will need to wait until then as soon as this status is updated we will be able to observe that the customer which has ordered this particular gift card has now got a voucher so let's just refresh this page and as you can see the voucher is successfully credited to the customer's account of 500 dollar amount that we have set and now a customer can easily can easily uh, use this voucher to order any product that he or she wants in case of mary do she can order anything using these vouchers now let me just take you to the back end where this extra option is added gift card orders under this particular section gift card orders you can see all the vouchers that has been generated after the customer has placed order you can click on this view voucher button to see the voucher code and on clicking this view button you would be taken to the cart rule section here you can also uh, customize the details of uh, voucher from here and the same would be updated on the customer sent to so this was all about the presta shop gift card module i hope i was able to clarify all the doubts and was able to explain you the functionality of the module in a better way thank you